Today we're talking about how to find the perimeter and area of a trapezoid. Normally that's pretty easy as long as you have both bases and the sides. But as you can see here, I'm missing the bottom base there. I have I have part of it, but not all of it. So I've got, and I know it's an isosceles trapezoid because 35 centimeters on each side, which is gonna be helpful. And I do know that this is 10 centimeters there, which is good. So what I wanna do is I'm gonna break this up into three pieces. So instead of having one trapezoid, I wanna have two triangles and a rectangle. Now I know those triangles are congruent because they just are. So it's 10 centimeters here, and I know that's 10 centimeters there, and that means that that's a, tr a rectangle, which means the opposite sides are equal, which means that's 50 centimeters. So what I have done is I've got 10 plus 50 plus 10, which is gonna give me a base of 70 centimeters. Now, I have the base, I can move forward. So here we go. Let me rewrite it there, 70 centimeters, and now the perimeter is as easy as could be. I'm just going to take 50 plus 35 plus 35 again plus 70. And again, you could write this in any order. It's still going to come out the same. And so the perimeter for me is going to equal, let me do a quick mental math here, and 190, oh, well, not inches, centimeters. Make sure you have those units. Those units are really, really important. And now that I have the base, now that I have the top base and the bottom base and the sides and the height, I can go ahead and do the area. So area is going to equal, we're going to add the top base, 50 centimeters, plus the bottom base, which is 70 centimeters. And then I'm going to divide that answer by two. And then I'm going to multiply all of that by the height, which in this case is 30. So let's see, let's work it out here. So, oh, almost forgot my parenthesis. So 120 divided by two times 30. And I got that 120 by adding 50 and 70 together. So 120 divided by two is gonna give me 60 times 30. And so my area is 1,800 centimeters squared. And that is how you do it. So I hope you found this helpful uh, and thanks for watching.